14 lane changers <laughs> yeah. uh, what was the deciding factor here this one? Um they they made some they made plays down the stretch of the game the last couple minutes. I think we had a couple turnovers, just a couple miscues, but um once again the positives first. Guys battled their tails off uh against a, a team that's that's been going lately. And um Across the board, we couldn't ask for anything better. We just came came up a little short, and um, it's a growth moment for us. We'll continue to grow from this. Speaking of growth, a much better third quarter. What to you was the difference out of the locker room this time versus the last few games? Um, the guys just wanted it, and um, we've been talking about having a more of a sense of urgency. And you know, they came out of halftime knowing that they, we didn't play, we didn't play well in the first half. Well, second quarter we didn't play well, so. We kind of wanted to get back into the game and, and get some stops, get out and run a bit, make some shots. Jordan Hawkins kind of led us out of the half, so good to see him make some. But like I said, um, hard, hard, hard fought game by both teams. Give them credit. They made a few more plays down the stretch of the game. And what did you see just with the fourth quarter execution, especially late, that allowed them to kind of take off? Yeah, we got to be better. We got to be better with the turnovers down the stretch. Um, and. You know, that was the difference in the game. You look at the stat sheet, we had 18 turnovers. They had nine. They scored 27 points off our turnovers. So an area of improvement, you know, <clears throat> we've kind of had that up and down throughout the course of the year. So we'll continue to get better there. Right, in those situations, do you want to see more of Zion and B.I. working together? Uh, or is it kind of just not executing what you, what you did run in those situations? Well, we didn't execute, but they did a great job of being physical, getting climbing into our guys, scratching, clawing, not allowing us to catch the ball. And that's what teams are going to do, especially against the really good teams. They're going to be physical with our guys. We've got to take care of the basketball and get quality looks. If we do that, you know, maybe the outcome is different. Um, so it's just kind of where we are. And with that, do you feel like this is a situation where you kind of miss having CJ as that ball handler who can calm things down and you've leaned on Dyson? A lot tonight, didn't really run it back up point guard in the second half. Uh, how much did that kind of factor in just to the, the execution in the second half? It's, it's, it's definitely a factor, um, having guys that, that's out, that's not available. Uh, but there's no excuses. Nobody's going to feel sorry for us. And um, we got to continue to do what we just did tonight, play hard, compete, give ourselves a chance to win the game. We did. And um, it just comes down to executing at the end of the game. Big picture, uh, where are you offensively versus where do you want to be? Excuse me? Uh, just big picture, where, where are you guys as a team offensively versus where do you want to be? Uh, I, I don't think we want to be the best offensive team in the first eight games. Um, hopefully, we get to 40, 50, 60 games and we get our full roster. We, we can really see what we can do offensively. Thanks, yep, thank you.